Yo, what is good, everybody? It's your boy, Dunkster Nice, Rolo Tenado Jr. And exactly what the title says, exactly what this video is, we got the first release of the Yeezy Zebras, and this is the restock that's releasing this weekend. Today is Friday, so I hope everyone's having a good Friday, or wherever you guys are at. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. But without wasting anybody's time, let's just jump right into the video. So before I pull these guys out, I'm gonna go and start off with none other than the first release. This is the Zebras. This is the first release one, and just so I get any you know, misunderstoodments out there, anything that's misunderstood. I did want to clear things up where I pretty much got the pairs at. So this one was from Grills SF. If you guys are watching, shout out to you guys at Grills SF. And then the second pair I got none other than from Premium Sneakers in Berkeley, California. All the info will be down below in the description. And pretty much nothing has really changed. They just made it more widely available so you guys can actually get a pair um they are some slight significant differences from what i've been told i'll try my best to compare both of them and maybe you'll you'll learn a thing or two maybe you won't but um this is for you guys strictly so i'll just start off with the box and then we'll jump into the shoes starting first down here is the first release one these are both in size nine my true size and yeezys and then you have the ones that's restocking this weekend i don't really see a difference in the two but if you guys could point it out feel welcome to comment down below again this is from the first release and this one is from the second release so i don't really see too much of any differences on the boxes here is the first release one and here is the restock now like i said there's really not too many differences between the two except very small like small differences they did put in the zebras that i could point out but I'm just gonna pretty much show both the shoes that you guys see here. All right, y'all, so the one that's on the bottom is the one that first released, and the one on top that I'm moving the shoe around right now is the one that's being restocked this weekend. I mean, I don't really see too many of like differences on the shoe that you guys could see here. The one that I could pretty much point out is the one that's on the bottom is a slight difference of red. This one is darker, while they made the red on the restock a light, like a lot more vibrant. Which you guys could see here this is the two differences that you you guys can hopefully see in the light hopefully i'm making some kind of like justice to this video for both the supply 350 logo and i did also want to point out how the restock has such a you know this separation here between this i see that gap is a lot more compared to the ones that released first so here's the ones that released the first time around and if i get my you know my uh, index finger you could pretty much see that like it's almost touching it that's the um that gap the gap between it but when you get to the restock part it's a lot more spread out so hopefully you guys can see that there and then when we actually get to the back tab one thing i did want to point out well hopefully you know what i mean you guys could see if there's any significance or any differences between the two i want to just move the shoes you know at a slower pace hopefully you guys can see it here now this one is the restock and this one is the first time around what i did notice with the first pair that you know what i mean that release it's not enough space where they created where if i were to put two fingers in between here um i think some people were talking about how like this pull tab wasn't as much it wasn't as spacious you see what i mean like it's my fingers could pretty much get stuck in there and when you get to the restock Look at my fingers it's it's a lot more loose you know what i mean it's where you guys can pretty much pull the pull tab part on the back tab it's a lot more easier to i guess you know pull the shoes on or just have the, uh, the back tab to it so again this is the restock that you guys can see and then this one on this pair is the one that first came out so hopefully that's like some difference into it but otherwise that man you know i don't really see too much of a differences between the see the you know the, the two of the shoes that you guys obviously see here as i'm presenting to you guys i mean everything is pretty much alike and then when you do get into the soles itself i mean i they still kept that cream off-white like color so you know if i do move around the shoe hopefully you guys can see you know it's still the same thing they still kept that off cream that that yet off yellow that that off-white look to it so it's that's still the you know they kept the same um in terms of like the boost let me just go in and adjust this real quick 
in terms of like the boost now here's something very interesting about this shoe now this one um you know that you guys are seeing that i'm moving the shoe around this is the first time they um the one that released and this one right here is the restock now i did notice how this these little three lines circle dots here that you guys see is more spread out but on the restock has a bunch more that they do have on it you know what i mean and hopefully you know you could pretty much see it in the video but i did want to point that out how the first you know time they release it's not so much of these guys here but when you actually see on the boost material they they spread this thing out so much but um that's pretty much it and then again i did want to mention how again this is the first release one that's always on the bottom and this is the restock again i don't really know if you guys see any differences between the two it's pretty identical um i know some mention about you know maybe there was a difference in both um the front this little stripe here um that's pretty much it still dead on like again this is the first release and you have the restock right here so i don't know if you guys see any differences in the two i'll move it a little bit slower for you guys so you could catch on and look at it from this angle here and you know move it around a little bit i don't really see any differences again that's just it the lace work Maybe you guys see any differences. I took out the stuffing so I could tell the difference between the first one I released and then the restock. See, that's right there. That's the, um, the stuffing and tissue. But otherwise than that, everything is pretty much still the same with the, the zebras, y'all. Nothing's really like changed so much on it. Now, one thing I did want to point out that I did see something different on the restock is they did have the sticker that was a lot larger in terms of this way. You know, the sticker is like a landscape type sticker that you guys see here in, in the insides of the zebras that's the only really difference i did spot out in terms of like where the sticker placement and everything is so hopefully you guys can see that there which is like this right here in terms of the zebras i really don't see that much of a difference in terms of the two i mean hopefully this video did justice for you guys to pretty much see the difference between you know what i mean the one that did come out and then the restock pair which you know is not this one which is this one here so um that's just pretty much with the two and if you guys are wondering besides the things that i did point out in this video is the price point of the sneakers itself you could pretty much get a pair now for like six hundred dollars um seven hundred dollars it's a lot cheaper compared to what it was before when people were paying like a thousand or twelve hundred fifteen eighteen two thousand those pipe points in just in general with the zebras if you guys are wondering where i did get my zebra pair like i stated before in the beginning of the video i did get it in premium sneakers in berkeley california so if you guys are in the bay area and you guys are looking to get a pair of the zebras you guys can get them in premium sneakers in berkeley california real easy to get they got pairs available they're legit nothing to worry about so shout out to the shop shout out to brandon if he's watching this video you know what i mean they hooked your boy up so again shout out to premium sneakers in berkeley california make sure you guys follow them i'll put all the information down below in the description all right y'all i hope you guys like this video hit that thumbs up if you haven't yet subscribe to your boy if you haven't i would really appreciate that comment down below what you guys still think about the zebras if you think they're still hot hype if you do like them or not and if you guys are planning to get them this weekend good luck to you guys and if you did win a pair or actually get a pair from the app or actually a store or wherever you got it at congrats to you i'm gonna wrap up this video and i'll see you guys from the next video and i think you guys already know it's gonna be good